Today we will learn acids and bases. For acids, we have hydrochloric acid, sulfuric acid, and nitric acid. For bases, we have sodium hydroxide, zinc oxide, and sodium oxide. But wait, what is acids and base? Acid can be defined as a chemical compound which ionizes or undergoes dissociation of water to produce hydrogen ions. While base is a chemical compound which reacts with acids to form salt and water only. Always remember that acids have low pH and contain lots of hydrogen ions. Otherwise, bases have high pH and contain lots of hydroxide ions. As you can see here, sulfuric acid dissolves in water to form hydrogen ion and sulfate ion. As I mentioned before, acid contains of a lot of hydrogen ion. Hence, sulfuric acid is an acid. Next, hydrochloric acid dissolves in water to form hydrogen ion and chlorine ion. Again, it's an acid. Here are some uses of acids. And here are some uses of bases. Hey, let's proceed to properties of acids. For the physical properties, it is sour in taste, corrosive, pH value of less than 7, and changes blue litmus paper to red. For chemical properties, it reacts with reactive metals such as magnesium, aluminium, zinc, and iron to release hydrogen gas. It reacts with metal carbonates such as calcium carbonate to release carbon dioxide. And it reacts with bases to form salt and water. And next, let's proceed to properties of bases. For physical properties, alkali tastes bitter and feels slippery corrosive, pH value of more than 7, and changes red litmus paper to blue. For chemical properties, it neutralizes acid solution to form salt and water. And when heated, the alkali reacts with ammonium salts such as ammonium chloride to produce salt, water, and release ammonia gas. That's all from me. Till we meet again. Bye!